Instead of spending hours recording voiceovers, you can now use Google AI Studio to turn your script into realistic sounding speech in seconds. With the powerful Gemini speech generation tool, we can transform text into over 30 studio quality, natural sounding AI voices. Whether you're making a podcast, an audiobook, or need a video narration, this feature is a total game changer. The text to speech generator is free to use, so let's head over to Google AI Studio and try it out. So here's the Google AI Studio homepage. Here's where we can perform all sorts of tasks with AI, including turning our text to speech. I've tested other text to speech tools out before, and some of them were pretty bad. But let's test it out in Google AI Studio and see how it sounds. To generate speech, let's start by going to the Generate Media tab. Here's where we can access various AI models to generate media. Since we want to generate speech, we're going to select the Gemini Speech Generation model, where we can generate high quality text to speech with Gemini. So let's click it here to open it up. And here's where we can use AI to turn our text into speech. If you look at the right hand side menu here, you'll see there are several options you can select from. Under Mode, we can select to create audio for a single speaker or multiple speakers. For our first example, I'm just going to create audio for a single speaker. When you switch modes, you'll notice the preview change as well. So before I select the AI voice I want to use, let's add my text prompt. For this example, let's say I'm still working on the ad for my coffee shop client and I want to add a high quality voiceover to the video to make it more professional. To do this, we can simply add our prompt to the text field here and tell the AI exactly what we want. For my coffee ad, I'm going to tell the AI to read in a calming and relaxed tone. And for the script, I want it to say, at our coffee shop, you can sip the moment and taste the vibe. And now that I've described what I want the AI to say and how I want it to say it, let's go back to the menu on the right hand side and select the voice. If we click the drop down menu here, we can select from over 30 different AI voices that we can use. To preview a voice, simply click the play button on the left hand side of the name. Ready to build something awesome today? Got a project in mind? What do you want to explore? Ready to make something amazing? What sparks your interest? As you can see, you can find pretty much any type of voice that you want, and each voice is super high quality. So take your time and browse through the various voices. For my voice, I'm just going to go with this one here. So now that I've selected my mode, added my text prompt, and selected a voice, let's go down to the bottom here and click the Run button. AI will then analyze my prompt and generate my speech. Generating this short tagline should only take a second. And once it's finished, your audio file will be available at the bottom here. So let's play my new AI generated speech and see how it sounds. At our coffee shop, you can sip the moment and taste the vibe. Not bad. I think this will work great with my ad. So to download my new audio file to use with my ad campaign, let's click the three dots icon on the right hand side here. This will open up a menu where we can adjust the playback speed or download the file. Let's click the download tab. And my new audio file has been downloaded to my device. I can now add it to my coffee shop ad campaign to have a professional voiceover. At our coffee shop, you can sip the moment and taste the vibe. I think that'll work perfectly. So we've gone over how to generate single speaker audio. Now let's click the next mode here to generate multi-speaker audio. This will take us to a menu where we can generate audio for multiple speakers. So to create my script, let's go to the script builder tool in the middle here. Here's where you can add the dialogue for your speakers. At the top here, you can use the text field to add your style instructions. This is where you can tell AI how you want your script to be read. For my script, I'm going to create a dialogue between a digital marketer and an old grumpy hardware store owner. So for my style instructions, let's tell AI that speaker one should have a friendly, excited tone and speaker two should have a skeptical, grumpy tone. I think that should make for a fun interaction. And once you add your system instructions, you can go down to the section underneath here to add your dialogue. For the first two lines of dialogue, simply select the text here and change it to whatever you want it to say. So for speaker one, I'm going to add the first line of text for my digital marketer. And for speaker two, I'm going to add the first line of text for my grumpy hardware store owner. There we go. So I've added the first line of text for each speaker. But to add more text, simply go down to the bottom here and click the Add Dialogue button. You can then add even more lines to your script to create your full dialogue. So let's finish creating the conversation between my digital marketer and my grumpy hardware store owner. 
For this example, I'm going to keep the conversation short with only a few lines. And after adding your script, you can look at the section on the left hand side here to view the raw structure. This basically shows you how to structure your script for an API request. But now that I've added my script, let's go to the menu on the right hand side here and select my speaker voices. From the voice settings section, I can select the voice for both of my speakers. For my digital marketer, I'm going to select a speaker with an upbeat middle pitch. And for my grumpy hardware store owner, let's select a speaker with a firm lower middle pitch. And there we go. So now that I've added my script and selected the voices for my speakers, let's go down to the bottom here and click the run button. AI will then analyze my script and my settings and start generating my speech. And this may take a few moments, but once it's finished, your AI generated speech should be available at the bottom left here. From here, you can preview the audio or download it by clicking the three dots icon on the right hand side here. And once you download your audio, you can use it for your voiceovers, your narrations or any other project you're working on. So let's check out the AI generated dialogue between my digital marketer and my grumpy old hardware store owner. Mr. Jenkins, my SEO plan will put your hardware store on Google's front page. Keywords, blogs, local search, boom, customers galore. SEO. Sounds like a scam. My sign out front works fine. Your website's on page 10. We'll optimize it, add best tools near me, and get everyone buying your hammers. Fine. Try it. But if I don't see sales, you're repainting my sign. <laughs> Not bad. I think the voices actually sounded super realistic. So if you need realistic speech or dialogue, head over to Google AI Studio and give it a try. The voices are super high quality and it's free to use. So that's a quick overview of how to use the speech generator on Google AI Studio. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.